Missing the party. Come on. Greetings, tribe, and welcome to Snacking with Ortega. I'm your host of Extraordinary Magnitude, Ortega Latrobe, and today we're doing steak bomb rice and beans. A steak bomb is basically New England's version of the Philly cheesesteak. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take that sandwich out of the bread and put it in a bowl here today. And here's what we're going to use. We've got some thinly sliced beef, thinly sliced onion, tri-colored bell pepper, jalapeno, fresh chopped tomatoes, and some black beans. We will also be using garlic, a bit of oil, adobo and black pepper, paprika, ground red pepper, and cayenne. And last, but certainly not least, mayonnaise, American cheese. Yeah. Now, in the words of the legendary Mills Lane, let's get it out. Drizzle our oil into a hot pan. Add our beef. Hit it with the adobo pepper mix. And stir. Now we're going to cook this all the way through. We're just going to get it browned up, break down some of the fat, and get some of this beef juice out there so we can saute our veggies in it. Our meat's good and brown. We're just going to transfer it over to this bowl and set it aside. Remember to keep all those nice beef juices in the pan to saute your veggies with. You get a deep beefy flavor. All right. Onions in. Peppers in. Jalapenos in. And stick. Just gonna let these veggies saute till they soften up, probably five, seven minutes or so. Right. Just gonna lid these up and let them do their thing. See you back here in a second. Did you miss me? Our vegetables are good and softened up. Now, we're going to take and add our black beans and our tomatoes and stick. Gonna mix these in, let those tomatoes break down, create just a little bit of a sauciness and a sweetness to this. When it's about finished, we'll hit it with some garlic, our final bit of seasonings, throw that meat back in, let it simmer for about 10 minutes and all come together, and then we're gonna serve it up, yeah! So, see you back here again shortly. All right, we're back. Our veggies are ready. We're gonna reduce the heat, add our garlic, then our cayenne, ground red pepper, and paprika. Stir all that in. Add our beef back in with all its juices. And we're just gonna let everything simmer together for another five minutes or so, just so all those flavors get the osmosis. The osmosis. The osmosis. Our steak bomb mix is ready, so we're gonna take it off the heat. And then we're gonna add that mayo. Stir that in real well. Let's give a nice creamy tangy to this. Oh, that smells fucking fantastic. Steak bomb. Let's build this bowl. A scoop of rice, a scoop of rice, times two in the bottom of the bowl. A scoop of rice, it sets the base for the steak bomb. Filling the yo. Take a scoop of the filling and lay it over the top. Then you gotta take a piece of American cheese. Just tear it and layer it across that first scoop of stuff. Take another one. Put it in there. It will be so fucking good you can't stand it. Alright, and more scoopy scoopy. Let that filling sit on top. Melt that cheese down. Just give that a couple minutes to all come together. As a matter of fact, let's just fucking try it, man. Stir it all together, get that rice mixed in, melty cheese, stir it around, sauce combined. Oh, ho, ho, dude, the more I stir, the more I yearn. So we want to get ourselves a good bite. Definitely got to get steak in there, so then taters and then onions and the rice. Mmm. 
Oh, man. God damn it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is really, really good. This is a brilliant idea. You've got all those fresh sauteed veggies, really tender steak, and the sauce that was created with that mayo and tomato all breaking down. It's almost like liquid cheeseburger flavor. It's just really wonderful. You throw it at that rice, it helps bring it all together, and that melty American cheese, which I know seems so weird, but the mayo and the American cheese would literally make this dish so goddamn amazing. Ah. Oh. Fucking hey, something good did come out of New England. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to get back to eating this. Thank you all for stopping by the Hacienda and spending your time with us here this evening. This has been Steak Bomb Rice and Beans. I've been Ortega Latrobe, and you've been snacking with Ortega. Pity the backseat.